Hello everyone, my name is Nadeem and today in this video we will be discussing about segregation of concrete and how to prevent it. Before that, if you like the videos I make, please do like, comment and share and don't forget to click the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to get the latest video updates. Segregation of concrete Segregation of concrete means separation of ingredients from designed fresh concrete resulting in non-uniform mix. More specifically, this implies the separation of coarse aggregates from the mortar because of differences in size, density, shape and other properties of ingredients in which they are composed. Because of segregation, honeycomb is created in the concrete and it basically affects the strength of the concrete and its porosity. During construction work, segregation in concrete can occur on site and it affects the durability of your structure. If you are constructing your own house, or working on a site, you have to understand about segregation of concrete. In a good concrete, all the ingredients are properly distributed to make a homogeneous mix. If a concrete sample exhibits a tendency for separation of coarse aggregates from the rest of the ingredients, it indicates segregation in concrete which depends upon the dryness or wetness of the concrete mix. Types of segregation in concrete There are mainly two types of segregation in concrete. The first type says the coarser and the heavier particles tends to separate out or setting down from the rest of the mix because they tend to travel faster along a slope or settle more than the finer materials. This type of segregation may occur if the concrete mix is too dry. The second type says grout which is water plus cement separating out from the rest of the material because of the lowest specific gravity. This type of segregation may occur if the concrete mix is too wet. A well-designed concrete does not segregate if rightly mixed and batched. Following are the major causes of segregation in concrete. The difference in the specific gravity of the mixed constituents, that is, fine aggregate and coarse aggregates. Difference in the size of aggregates, improper grading and handling of aggregates, bad practices of handling and transportation of concrete, too much vibration of concrete, concrete that is not proportioned properly and are not mixed adequately placing of concrete from a greater height and the last concrete is discharged from a badly designed mixer or from a mixture with worn out blades now let us see how to prevent segregation of concrete at the time of construction especially while using transit mixers care should be taken that the concrete is not poured from a height greater than 1.5 meters aggregate should be properly graded as it will prevent the segregation to improve the viscosity of concrete which prevents the segregation, air entraining agents can be used. In case of mass concreting, where mechanical vibrators are used, care should be taken that they are not used for a longer period. I hope you found this video useful. If you like the video, then please like, comment and share. And don't forget to click the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to get the latest video updates. Thank you for watching. 